Atlanta United Fan TV here with Grego. Damn, that feels good, man. You know, it's been a while, man. It's been a while. It's been a while. Yeah, what's going on, man? Yeah. And uh, you know, to get that away goal at Yankee Stadium, where not many teams have really gotten points or a win, you know, and uh, for us to get that, you know, kind of get off the snide a little bit. Uh, we were hearing a lot of that narrative of people getting on our back, and uh, I think it feels doubly good because of that. You know, it's, it's, it's tough being Atlanta sports fans. So, you know, to, to get this win after how things went last, last uh, before last, yeah. but, uh, but yeah, just uh, getting, that, getting that win, getting us, you know, off the, out, off the hump and just back into the swing of things, I think that'll go service pretty well going into next weekend. Yeah, sure, sure. And, uh, you know, coming in, uh, we saw the lineup, and it was Miggy starting. Definitely a little bit of a risk and worry. Good to see him come off of the half, probably uninjured. We don't know yet, but, uh, you know, I think he brought so much to the game, and it was he was definitely just in control of it. Yeah, the first, uh, I probably said the first 20 minutes or so, it was, like, was kind of rough, you know, just having NYS, NYC just uh, keeping that uh, possession and having those attacking ch and chances, but once we settled down, like we really had some good opportunities. You know, of course, we had the the goal that, uh, that got called back, which was kind of bullshit. But uh, but you know, well, no, I mean, essentially, it was Miggy. You know, he had come from an offside position when he came out on the corner, so I get it on semantics, that. Semantics, semantics, <laughs> semantics. But yeah, you know, of course, we 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 settled down. Of course, even after that, because it's it's very easy to. Just easily, just just kind of lose yourself and be like, okay, we're trying to, and, and panic. But you know, we, we we settled down, kept things in control, got uh, got to go before halftime, and you know, and really defended well going um, in, into the second half. So I think that you know, going into the second leg, you know, like we're not in the in the greatest position, but at the same time, you know, we have that away goal, which will go, which will go a long way. Yeah, that uh, that second goal that Sean Johnson saved, um, yeah. yeah, or that one that was a chance that he saved. Yeah, I mean, I, it kind of hurts, but I think we're still in very, very good position going into the Benz. Uh, what's your expectation going in? Pain. <laughs> I'm just, but no, I, I think that, you know, with everyone relatively healthy, there's no red cars or anything, I think that we should be able to, to have to – have, at least a, a, a good win, uh, whether it's whether it's a draw. Like I said, we should be able to, to advance, no, no problem. Um, I think that, you know, if if we stay focused, we're good. I think that, you know, as long as if we, if we get away from our game and start, you know, trying to think that we're trying to do too much, that's when things can happen, like like with a chance with um, with with, uh, with with Viaba. You know, just you think that you have that you have the goal, and then it, you don't have it. I think that it's always important to you know keep your focus, keep your discipline, and and the results will show. Now uh, you're doing some good things, uh, you know, for the culture, literally, and uh, yeah, give us uh, give the fans a little bit of uh, what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, we we uh, we just uh, debuted a uh, po uh, our podcast uh, for the culture. Uh, you can find us at uh, at FTC UTD on on Instagram and Twitter. You know, just on uh, uh, giving a different perspective of the game, and uh, you know, and uh, it's uh, me, uh, two of my guys, uh, Ringo and uh, Coach Tony, and uh, of course, well, of course, hopefully, we'll have my my man AJ on on the show pretty soon. But yeah, check us check us out. You know, like we are we're delivering good uh, good content. You know, uh, I think hopefully a, a, a fresh perspective on on the game. And you know, like I said, hopefully, hopefully y'all 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 enjoy it. Yeah. And uh, so, in terms of uh, you know this, just final thoughts on on this match, man. Like in terms of them coming to the Benz, uh, do you think NYCFC have a chance? Um, I mean, what what do we need to do to shut them down? Just stay focused. I think that you know, I think with a, with most of our team, especially considering you know what happened last year. You know, at at home against against the crew, you know, you think that you have all the all the utilities to to win, but you know, sometimes things don't go your way, and I think it's very important to, especially since we at least have the lead going into the second leg, is to, if nothing else, don't panic, you know, stay focused, and you know, if you get a chance, you know, of course, take it, but you know, if not, you know, defend, stay in position, and and like I said, uh, we'll we'll get through. I hope we do, and uh, I appreciate your time, man. No problem.